My favorite song of Remo, which he choreographed, is this epic song called Garmi. <laughs> that was my song. I was supposed yes. to say that. <laughs> I've seen people coming to me, parents coming to me, getting their child and saying, I have to make a dancer. They say that it's not Shadu Khan, it's an emotion. Hello people, my name is Reema Chabra and you are watching Showreel on OTT Play. And today we have with us for a super fun conversation, two dance maestros, Remo D'Souza and Noura Fatehi. Hello. Thank you. Hi. How are you doing? Good. How is it going with Hip Hop India? Super. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. amazing. It's a vibe. Okay, so yeah. firstly, I would, I would like to know that what is the most difficult part of being a judge? Because I'm sure you love all the dance forms, you love everyone dancing, but you also have to judge it. So yeah. please tell us. Uh, earlier, the other shows which I do, which I did, uh, I found it very hard to say no and reject. That you don't select, you don't go out. So that was the hardest part. Uh, thankfully for this show, yeah. uh, especially this one, there's uh, nothing like that. So that's why I love it more. That you don't have to do that. Okay, Nora. Yeah, same. Definitely, it's always saying no is difficult. And I was judging a kid's show, so that used to be very yeah. difficult to say no to them, just break their heart. Um, but here, I love the fact that it's very raw and we just keep it real. And um, we are encouraged to have no filters on the show. Yeah. Right, amazing. So Hip Hop India is the first dance reality show that has come to India. How did all this, you know, come together? How did it take place? How did it take place? I mean, the makers, uh, this question is for makers actually, how it came to place. But uh, as soon as they said that this is hip hop this show, concept, hai, yeah. as a concept, hai, of course I jumped in and they said that Nora is even better. <laughs> if you hip hop ki baat kar rahe and Nora is the best, you will be able to do it because you represent the people who are in this culture, who are in this dunya. Ko hai. And uh, who else better than Nora? Actually? Yes, sir. Yeah. Amazing. I'm sure people are waiting for you both to, you know, come on the screen and judge because my mom personally, she is a biggest fan of dance reality shows or any shows for that Fantastic. matter. But also when we talk about reality shows or dance reality shows, uh, there is also a concept, not really concept concept, but you know, there uh, people say that there are always a lot of emotional angles attached to the, uh, you know, uh, uh, contestants. Well, not no, not here. No. no, not at all. Not Are at you all. sure? Absolutely. <laughs> not at and all. And no crying after no. looking There's at this story. nothing. <laughs> this is just come and show me your skill. Yes. Yeah. Show me what you got. You come on stage, you dance your heart away, and you represent hip hop in its truest form. Good. And that's how we judge everybody. And we only want to know where you're from. Right. We want to understand your, your, which gully you're which from, gully you're from. <laughs> what your story is, how you learned. And how come hip hop is is the lifestyle you chose? That's the only thing we care about. And take them from the gully to the glory. Yes. yes. So how excited are you? And do you think that this show is going to go from gully to the glory? Absolutely. I mean, it is going. I mean, the way the response is getting, we getting the response. It is going that way, and it is going for the glory. And uh, we just started. And yeah, we just started. Yeah, we just started. Okay. So uh, as you both are sitting together here with me, I would like to know that Nora, which is your favorite song of uh, Remo that he has choreographed and which is your favorite song of Nora that she has performed? My favorite song of Remo, which he choreographed, is this epic song called Garmi. <laughs> that was my song. I was supposed to say that. Yes. <laughs> I knew. I knew. I knew. You will say this answer. Okay, but apart from that. <laughs> of course, I mean, he's... I, I would do injustice to his career uh, success by just naming one. He's just blown. He's made a mark in the industry. That's true. He's like sets the bar and then he comes and then sets the bar even higher and then he does it again and sets it even higher and it's like, <laughs> what's going on here, you know? So, I mean, the way he choreographed Pinga in yes. Sanjay Dilip Hansali Sir's film in, in every way possible from the dance to the the look of it to how he just structured the two yeah. you know one of the biggest heroines of our industry um and it, it's an art form in itself you know so so as you talk about all the you know reality shows and everything but there is still a section of people who believe that dance can only be a hobby and it cannot be a profession but you guys are coming here you're proving everything but how do you feel when people look down upon an art this way uh, of course uh with me, it happened a lot because when I started also, it, it was the I'm same sure, thing. I'm sure, I'm sure. And being a Air Force kid, 
uh, to oh, do yeah. this was uh, even harder yeah but mai dekhta aata hu sab i've seen it and uh, still there are people but i've seen the change i've seen people coming to me parents coming to me getting their child and say ki mujhe inko isko dancer banana mm. and uh, this is one incident which i all i can't forget and i want to say this i went for this uh, ramp show mm -hmm. of the kids mm. i was a chief guest and these were uh, uh, the kids and before they introduce themselves i mean the announcer comes and says ye this kid is coming and his hobby is this and he wants to become this 10 kids walk walked on the ramp yeah five of them they wanted to become either choreographer or dancer wow five of them unbelievable that's so amazing so you see big deal. and they were and they had supporting parents they were supporting parents. wow unbelievable <laughs> so do you think that reality shows are helping people yeah. understand yes. these yes. things yeah wow. and reality shows success stories yeah. social media um you guys yeah you know success stories yeah <laughs> different different opportunities are opening up which probably were not there before right you right you know um Yeah. But do you also feel that there is a kind of burden on your shoulders कि आप लोग जो represent कर रहे हो उससे बहुत सारे लोग ऐसे हैं जो शायद खुद parents को भी नहीं बता पा रहे होंगे कि हमको ये opportunity you know pursue करनी है but they look upon to you and then they tell you know their parents की अरे look at Ramo look at Nora where they have gone we also want to do it so do you think there is a uh, any kind of possibility कि आपके uh, shoulders पे burden है uh, <coughs> burden तो नहीं कहूँगा but uh, I mean, it's a it's feeling होती है कि अच्छी feeling आती है कि यार चलो there are people who get inspired and they say कि चलो हमको भी ये वाला रास्ता अपनाना है so एक अच्छी feeling आती है but burden वैसा वाला feel I I never feel not a burden but it's I always want to uh, talk about my story I always want to yeah, tell inspire. people how what the journey was like what it involved in to help other people whoever is watching. Right, right. Also, Rama, I would like to know that uh, you and Shahrukh Khan go a very long way. Yes, you absolutely. have worked together absolutely. as well. But uh, there's this one thing that he has said that you succeeded because you believed in your craft and passion. Yes. So, what was your biggest takeaway from the superstar? Uh, I mean, Shahrukh Khan. <laughs> I mean, I know that itself is a definition. <laughs> I mean, आपने ये एक नाम दे दिया. Taken his name only, it's become. Uh, इसके ऊपर कुछ नहीं हो सकता That's true. So, and this is not, I'm talk, not talking about now that he said it now. I'm saying when back then, yeah. when I was behind him, when I saw him working like that, I know that man is still the same. Mm -hmm. He is exactly the same. The passion, the hard work, everything what I've seen then, and what I saw recently when I did a song for Zero. it's same thing wow. so that is the biggest take uh, take away from him because uh, and, you know liya ki whatever you do do it with your heart yeah so his passion is genuine yeah his yeah. passion is genuine you can't and that i mean wo kehte hai na ki shahrukh khan shahrukh khan nahi hai wo ek emotion hai That's so. true. That's so true. And you know the best part is whenever I ask anybody anything about Shahrukh Khan, I always get all beautiful answers. Absolutely. It's just like कोई बनाकर कुछ नहीं बोलता है. सबका experience है उनके साथ. It's so beautiful. अच्छा anyway, uh, I want to ask a tricky question. That what according to you is a song that is not choreographed by you and not performed by <coughs> you is uh, a song that you did not like and you would have thought that I might have done better than this and you might have performed better than this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure there must be something on your head. <laughs> something, a lot of many things. things. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Everyone has done this. Uh, yeah. Oh my God. Let's not throw shade. Yeah. We can be really yeah, yeah, shady yeah. if we yeah. want to be. But in the end of the day, I think it's in it's, our yeah, nature that anytime we see something, we're like, ah, oh, yeah. kashagar <laughs> main hoti hu, yeah. You know, so that's that's natural. It's normal. And I'm sure when Sir sees something yeah, in his oh, brain, he'll visualize like, oh, could have yeah. done this. But that's just a natural state of mind for any artist, you know. True. Yeah. True. But we're hungry. We want to do everything. Yeah. <laughs> You are, you are doing everything. You are everywhere. My friends are going to be so jealous that I'm sitting with you guys oh, here. Oh, what's that? Oh, thank you so much for your Thank time you so and all much. the best thank for the show. Thank you. Thank you.